Hi, so I'm going to show you my mitosis puzzle activity. This mitosis puzzle activity is on Google Slides. I do also have this as a paper version where uh, students will cut out puzzle pieces and uh, paste those. So if you have uh, a, if you're at a school where they have one-to-one -one technology, where students have access to an iPad, Chromebooks, or a desktop uh, computer, then this activity would be amazing for them. So um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you if you purchase the activity, you will have a link that will take you to make a copy. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to put make a copy. And it takes about a few seconds. It will pop up and you will see that it says copy of mitosis puzzle and I can go ahead and I can rename it. I can take out copy of and I'm just gonna name it mitosis puzzle. And so the first page is just going over the what students will be doing and the nice thing about this is the background is all down to where if students on accident go like this they won't be able to shift and move around anything. The only thing they will be able to move around is the puzzle pieces. So you will see the fourth page has the puzzle pieces. The second page, it goes by first stage, second stage, third stage, fourth stage, fifth stage, and sixth stage. I called it stage um, just because I want them to think what happens first, then second, then third. Um, I also have included um, interface in here. Even though interface is not technically part of mitosis, I still wanted my students to know where it all begins, okay? And so um, the third page at the very end after students go ahead and put their all their puzzle pieces down, they can click right here. I added a text box and then they can just write their reflection or type their reflection. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you um, the puzzle pieces are not in order. It just so happens that this one is first. So I'm going to control C, which is going to copy it. And I'm going to go to where it belongs. So I know that that is interphase. And I know that that's going to happen first. So I, so I will go and I will place that on there. And then I will go back. And what I like to do is I like to erase it or delete it so that I don't get confused and it's gone. And then I would go and I would get another puzzle piece. This right here is metaphase. And I know it goes interphase, prophase, metaphase. And it might be easier for students also to name it first before they put on the, uh, the drawings. So I can even go back here, let me erase that one. And I can start with, I know interphase is first. I can put that there and then I know prophase but again like I said I know interphase is not part of mitosis but I still want my students to know what's going on there so prophase is gone do metaphase and so on okay and um, this is just a quick uh, draft so that you can see what it would look like, but then students would go and they would finish all the other puzzle pieces. And it looks really, really cool in the end. And again, students will write that reflection and then they can submit it through Google Classroom. It makes it super easy when students just submit it through Google Classroom and it's very, very simple to grade. So thank you so much for watching my video.